welcome to a very fun craft unboxing, Toucan Box. The warning label is kind of covering up all the fun part of here. The fact that they actually put your child's name right on the front. And we haven't opened one of these in a couple months. We used to get this one quite a lot. It is one of the most more uh, affordable. Is welcome back, Isabeau. It's I have flower cup. Yeah. That is my flower cup. And it's one of the more affordable craft kits, and there is a whole ton to go inside. They just recently redid their boxes, so I'm learning as we go. It's a little slidey, slidey. And I believe that this is the Easter set. So we will double check. Oh, oh, look at that. It actually has all of the literature right in here. Oh, oh. so like I said, yeah, I'm learning this box with y'all. So, oh, it looks like it's going to unfold out here, but the adhesive is really strong. Oh, there's a rip tab. Eh. Eh. So it, there we go. It unfolds completely like this. Wait, wait, we have to show our friends. No. Yeah. So each month comes with a booklet. The booklets have gotten much bigger and they are absolutely action packed. There are games and activities for a lot of different age levels and color pages, all sorts of fun things. They usually have recipes. And now they have a ton of pages. Now, instead of being more of a booklet for adults or like parents to make connections, which there are a few things like that in here. It's more specifically for kids to do extra things for themselves with some matching like puzzles and patterns because this is a STEM box and it's made for kids to discover. You wanna check this one out? All right. So, I just I just rejoined um, because they, again we had amazing deals and I was like we're all home right now so I'll put the link down below for fifty percent off your first box and let's see what we got we have oh wait 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 so each box comes with at least two completely separate crafts we usually get four and it has all the materials you get that you need you have Zuma. Why do you have Mighty Zuma? Because I have Zuma for my best. Oh, okay. Um, so usually it contains like everything you need, like the crayons that you'll need, even things like the glue and stuff like that. So the first one we have a bunting and a headband with bunny ears. And I think that is so cute. So everything is in color. It has all of the instructions. So some of them have a lot of steps to them, like things to practice cutting, coloring, and painting, stringing. And some of them are more simple, like this bunny headband. Okay. Yeah. Here. Oh, gosh. We are going to give this one to Bobo right now. It is a magnet of the ocean. What a cool surprise. Here you go, Bobo. There we go. Oh my gosh, so I just started going back to it because my lovely co-host is in the bath. And I realized that when you open it properly with the little arrow, underneath where the book was, it actually opens up so you only see ugh, half at a time. So you're not just opening a big pile. That's so cool. Hey, look at that. There's a little surprise here. That's where the little magnet was. So I love this new box design. I'm a little bummed that I messed it up so badly because it's really cool. And oh, I hope it's not loud. It's just super cute now too. So get back to it. The other side has, I see a greenhouse. Oof. So a miniature greenhouse that we will be building out of little wood pieces with seed markers and it contains seeds. Ah, that is so cute. And it has stickers to decorate it with. 
labels and everything. Oh my word. I am so excited for this. So there we go, our little seed pods, the glue, the seeds, all of the pieces, and stickers to decorate with. Plus, every single month, we get at least one full sheet of stickers. And they're always fun and artsy, and obviously everything here is steam-based. So everything is made for creating and crafting and building and then looking deeper into it. And I can't remember if I said, so I'm gonna add it in anyway. Some of the crafts are very easy. This one, obviously, it's just bending. It's just bending pipe cleaner onto a headband. Super duper easy, but it's one of those fun little activities. And now that my assistant is not right here, I do want to show you guys some of the cool pieces here. So we've got a decent, like a decent like student quality watercolor paper for the eggs. They are all pre-punched. There are tons of them. It's not one of those things where you'll get like one or two tries and then you're done. Then these are for the chicks. And they are like a proper, like, ooh, um, cardstock. Very like thick and plush and fuzzy pipe cleaners. They're super duper long to make some super cute bunny ears. A headband. Wiggle eyes for the chicks. The yarn for string. So this is the garland itself. It's actually like super duper soft, which, oh, super duper matter if it's just hanging. And it includes the little plastic needle. Super neat. Oh. And no glue in this one, which is awesome because foam tends to be kind of weird. It has glue squares, little glue dots to put everything on. Some, oh, I ripped it. There we go. Some little foam shapes. Again, already uh, cut out for you. Ooh. And, oh, and then each little pack also has a themed single sticker too, which is super cute. Ooh, more dots. And a little bitty watercolor palette. Remember one box, we got tiny, tiny tubes of watercolor. I think Izzy will really like this one. It's got a lot of colors. So obviously they're going to be children's grade, but they look like really beautiful colors. And the brush looks decent quality. It's not like a one of the junky types. I mean, it's a decent little golden tack lawn. Um, and not one, but two white crayons. Well, that'd be really fun for doing like the wax resist on the eggs themselves. So, oh, and there's little feathers for the chick ones. So that is why I am so excited by the toucan kit. I think we use it a whole lot. It was one of those things that when we stopped getting it, because it did get, it did get out of budget for a little bit, it was something we definitely missed. So sometimes at like the Dollar Tree and if we can get out of town because we don't have one in our town, the Target and the Dollar Spot, they sometimes have little miniature craft kits. But I realize if you start like adding those ones up and maybe not at the Dollar Tree one, like you can get a handful of crafts for cheaper. But once you start getting like Dollar Spot ones, we're pretty similar on price. But there is not as much materials in a lot of them. In a lot of these... They are things that will take multiple steps. Um, they'll have enough materials to make mistakes. And they are things that can be played with and used, but not are necessarily like, oh, little junky toys that'll hang around. It's just really fun, you know, just fun extra pieces. So I like it a lot. And I am more than happy to subscribe again. Um, especially now that our little ones are here more often it wasn't as a parent when she was in daycare part time because she had a lot of that crafting energy out there and we you know we could substitute with a few gift little little gifty ones 
but this is awesome so that's really all I have to say I'm just kind of geeking out I'm so happy um yeah again there is a coupon code down below it will get you half off a box if you get one I don't get any money it's not sponsored but I will get half off another box so we'll just keep on making and I'm really really hoping to um be able to get a double subscription one one of these days. I'm not certain when because I'd love to actually film the making of these crafts. But I don't do that now because right now Izzy is able to do most of the steps. And they're for her. So that's all I really have. I love you all so much. Bye-bye.